Hello, it's me again, Sailor Gamer. Welcome to this brand new playthrough of XCOM Enemy Within. A real turn-based strategy game where we fight off an alien invasion. Well, I hope you enjoy, and off we go with part one. Let's begin, shall we? Okay. Yeah, we'll go with normal. It's been a while since I played this. It's options. Yes, the tutorial, male tutorial. Vision Prodigy. Those who play with the devil's toys won't be brought to the by Greece wield his sword. Buckminster Fuller. Oh boy. Coming fruit crash from the sky. Uh I want to get close to that if I were you. You don't know what it is. It could be dangerous. If that curiosity killed the cat, it could kill you too. See, I told you. And here comes another one. Sucking it in. Plug it in. Of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Very well. Good luck, Commander. That was the last transmission, sir. Patch me through to Voodoo 3 1. Okay. You were being deployed to Germany. At 1900 hour Zulu, several unidentified objects fell to Earth. After ruling out the possibility of a downed satellite, we now believe these objects to be extraterrestrial in nature. Shortly after impact, German officials received reports of mass hysteria and freak weather around one of the impact zones. Then things went dark. At 2100 hours, a chopper carrying a German military recon team went down in the area after they reported being fired upon. As you know, Germany is a member of the Council, and they have requested our assistance. Our mission is to assess the situation on the ground, ascertain the current status of the German recon team, and investigate the extraterrestrial objects. Central out. Okay. Begin the mission, shall we? Central, this is Big Sky. Looks like we found the crash site. Roger. 
Roger, Voodoo 3 1. Any sign of activity? Negative. Nothing's moving down there. Okay. Set her down nearby. Central, you getting all this? Copy that, Delta Squad. First things first, let's get you out of the open and into cover. Whatever did this could still be out there. Right. Delta One, take point. Take cover behind that debris directly in front of you. Gotcha. Use the mouse, select hide, places, and move the shoulder. Got okay. Right click, okay. A soldier can move up to two times per turn. Okay. Number of remaining moves entertained by on a soldier's unit flag. Okay. Good. Now advance to the vehicle nearby. Okay. Delta two, your turn. Move up to the debris. All right. Okay. That thing isn't going to offer you much cover, but it's better than nothing. There's full cover straight ahead. Okay. Advance to that position. Okay. Delta-3, move to that vehicle dead ahead. All right. Central, I have movement. 30 meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. All right. Delta-4, go check it out. It's a long way from your position, and there's no available cover between here and there, so you better double-time it. All right. Dashing. Holy hell. What do you see, Delta-4? Report. Looks like one of the recon teams, sir. It looks like something... Is that your man, Delta-4? Negative, sir. That's someone else. Dr. Valen, what's he saying? He is saying, help me. That radio transmission is coming from somewhere north of the squad's current position, based on its strength, probably from inside a structure. Thank you, Doctor. Delta, advance and infiltrate that building. And remember, stay in cover. A soldier may cover long distance by dashing. This will consume both moves and end the soldier's turn, okay? Dash away. I can go up here. Central, I got a lot of blood here. Roger. See where it's coming from. Okay. I go there. Central, I think I just found another one of the recon team. Or what's left of him. But this doesn't make sense. Looks like he's been dead for a week. Even more perplexing is the cause of death. It appears that he was eviscerated when something burst out of him from the inside. Sir, I have visual on the object. Permission to approach. It's the only cover between you and that building. Permission granted. Okay.
Talk to me, soldier. What is it? I got no idea what this thing is, but I can confirm that it's no satellite. All right. Roger. All right, Delta Squad. You're almost to the building. Keep moving. All right. Okay, people. Now let's get inside. Delta One, there's a window in front of you. Let's take a look. Okay. In position. Looks clear. Okay. Copy that. Get in there and get to cover. Oh, that makes some noise. Delta Two, that door's in our way. Take it down. That's gonna make some noise Close too. Copy. They definitely know we're here now. Central, we have eyes on the target. He's armed. Copy, Delta-3. Okay, everyone. Get into position nearby, but do not approach. Doctor, see if you can communicate with him. All right. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. Hello. Können Sie mich hören? Wir sind hier, um Ihnen zu helfen. Bitte lassen Sie Ihre Waffen fallen. Okay. He appears to be in shock. Keep your eyes open, people. I don't like the uh. looks of this. Okay. Delta-3, move in and disarm him. Carefully. All right. Careful here. One is down. Central, we're taking fire for multiple x-rays. This guy's got me pinned down, taking heavy fire. Got two down. Damn it. Delta two, your flank two. Find some better cover. All right. All right, Delta two. Weapons free. Get ready to fire. Okay. Okay. Eight percent chance to hit. Pretty good. Okay. Nice shot. Delta four, you're freed up to move. Get out of there and get into cover. All right. Now toss your grenade at the enemy in front of you. Bye. Now get ready for their counterattack. Look out, Delta Four. There's another one coming in behind you. Uh, there he goes. It. It's just you now, Delta Two. Let's tip the odds in our favor. Look around for a position where you can flank the enemy. Okay. That kind of That's it. Out. You have a clear shot from that position. Fire. Okay. 
Down you go, smart. Central, I think that's it. It's over. Roger that, Delta. Secure the bodies and head back to the Sky Ranger for immediate extraction. Oh shit, hit the fan. Weapons cost fifty percent less the bridge is built and maintain, yeah, North America. Affirmative. We are coming home. The only survivor. Whatever they are, they nearly took out a squad of our best soldiers. If you'll excuse me, doctors, the commander is waiting in mission control. Right. Their technology is far beyond ours. Then I'd say our work is cut out for us, doctor. Welcome to XCOM HQ, commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold providing tactical support for our field operations, and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. All right. Commander to the barracks. Commander to the barracks. Okay. Accepting the barracks. Commander, the soldier is waiting for you in the armory, which is located there in the barracks. Okay, good. Is that Hector G Guzman? Only one recruit from Delta Squad made it back alive from our last mission, Commander. And I'd say a promotion is in order. Okay. As you know, Commander, every soldier is different. This particular soldier has shown an aptitude for heavy weapons. As he gains additional combat experience, we should continue his training along these lines. Okay. Train. Fire rocket. This soldier will now carry a rocket launcher, in addition to his standard weapon. The aliens won't know what hit him. Okay. Oh. Dr. Vallen asked to see you in the research labs, Commander. It sounded important. Very well. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. On the way. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Vallen. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. Based on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. With your approval, we will begin research immediately. Very well. The aliens appear to be using material sour layers the aliens appear to using materials that are layers stronger than anything we've ever seen a cursor examination has already given us ideas for ways to improve search soldiers current armor but by armor but more search research is required Yes, I think that's more important than weapons for now. Thank you, Commander. This research will take some time. We will notify you once it is complete. 
Commander to mission control. Commander to it mission control. It sounds like you are needed elsewhere. Farewell, Commander. If you recover any additional artifacts during your field operations, I would be quite eager to study them. Yes, Commander Doc. to mission control. Commander to mission control. Okay. The enemy is testing our capabilities, Commander. We've gotten reports of simultaneous attacks in two different countries. We can only respond to one. The country we help will donate more resources to our cause. But the panic level of the country we choose not to help will rise. It's not an easy decision, Commander, but it's one you'll have to make. All right. We have established our sights. I like to think the number of scientists would be a good idea. Understood. The troops are waiting for you in the hangar. Commander, before deploying our squad, you can choose which soldiers to send out there. I've taken the liberty of calling up our veteran. His combat experience makes him invaluable on the battlefield. Okay, good idea. Launch mission. Prepare for deployment, Strike One. Get us out. Not? Okay, yeah, I'm dressing, dressing. Okay. Try not to lose anybody this time. We'll do our best. Hold on, soldier. Before you move out, let's see what's inside that building. Okay. Your squad mate is closer, so let him check it out. Okay. I'm on the move. Okay. Good. Now open the door. Quietly, so right. you don't reveal your position to the enemy. Use V. Okay. Now take cover inside. All right. Now I want a man on the roof of that building. See if you can find a way up there, soldier. Moving out. Go. Oh. Target there acquired. The rest of you, advance toward the enemy and get into cover. Hold your fire until I give the word. All right. Yes. Yeah. We'll cover. Ten four. We'll cover to you two. Been down here. He missed.
Moving out. Solid copy. Okay. Great work out there, people. The commander will be assuming command now as you sweep the rest of the area. As always, okay. I'll be offering tactical advice as needed. And remember, your armor can only withstand a couple of shots from their weapons. So keep your eyes open and your heads down. Good luck. All right. Careful, we. Heading to that location. And Locked and loaded. Got it. Moving. Okay, I'm moving there. That's affirmative. You know. It's killing time. Moving to position. You know. Back in. Hector, we went up there. Okay. When you up there on our war watch? Moving out. Are you on our watch? There on our watch. Going this very carefully. I'm on it, Commander. Moving to position. Look sharp. Enemies rolling up. That's affirmative. Our watch. Moving to position. Our watch. We shouldn't be that close together anyway. Like we learned on our last mission, people. These things have highly advanced weapons. Be careful out there. Commander, our veteran's rocket launcher should make easy work of the structure the aliens are using for cover. And if we're lucky, it'll take out the aliens along with it. That is, if it hits. Crap. Lost somebody. Heading there now. I'm on the move.
right. It's not firing. Fire! <sighs> You're seeing me, right? soldier. You only get one shot. Boom, boom, pow. Good work out there, Strike One. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Okay. Artifacts are being unloaded, and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. All right. Commander, we have an incoming transmission from the Council. Hello, Commander. We wish to congratulate you on your most recent victory. We realize you were faced with a difficult decision in responding to the various requests for assistance. Regardless, you performed admirably. As agreed upon, the reward for your actions has been granted. Farewell, Commander. We hope that you are met with continued success. Okay, now I can build a laboratory. Each laboratory increases speed. Research speed by 20%. Agency bonus 10% increase to research speed for every adjutant 
adjacent right, 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 use of build facilities option and engineer to construct this facility okay excellent squires at void the United States the XCOM squad deployed to the United States has successfully stopped the alien abduction in Kansas City. The United States has been grateful, grateful to your help and hopes that these rewards will be, be of use to your the XCOM project. Poor scientists, panic has increased across Asia. The Council knows you made the right decision, Commander. With the resources we have available, there's only so much we can do. However, our chief engineer did come up with something to help you keep an eye on things. The Situation Room provides constant monitoring of every member nation in the Council. If we allow panic levels to get out of control in any given nation, they're going to withdraw from the Council. And they'll take their funding and additional support with them. Okay. The Council's overall confidence in the XCOM project is shown on the primary meter above the main screen, which engineering has nicknamed the Doom Tracker. Commander to Mission Control. Commander to Mission Control. I know, eh? Commander, Dr. Vallen reports that research is progressing in the labs, but it will still be some time before the project is complete. While we're waiting, our local satellite network has just come online, and we can now begin scanning for new activity. The process could take several days. Okay. The schematics for the nanofiber vest are complete, Commander. Engineering is awaiting approval for fabrication. Okay. Commander, with this research complete, my staff and I currently have nothing to study. I would like to ask your permission to autopsy the alien cadavers retrieved from your last two field operations. I'm sure you would agree that if we're going to defeat the aliens, we must understand their physiology. Okay. Begin project. Thank you, Commander. I will let you know when this research has been completed. Engineering online. <laughs> it appears Dr. Shen's staff have finally figured out how to turn their machines on. Whoa, that's cool. Commander to engineering. Commander to engineering. Ah, Commander. I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. Speaking of which, Dr. Valen has just sent us some new schematics. With your approval, we will begin fabrication. Okay. Fabrication of the nanofiber vest is complete, Commander. It has been delivered to the armory. Commander to the barracks. Commander to the barracks. Okay. New items and weapons from engineering will always be delivered directly to the armory, Commander. All right. Check on your soldiers. Out. Okay. 
Commander to the Situation Room. Commander to the Situation Room. Out. Going to situation room. Commander, the council has requested a word. Commander, our sources have identified a number of reports regarding alien involvement in the transportation and dispersal of an unknown substance near civilian population centers. It is imperative that you investigate this activity and determine the purpose of the alien material. We will transmit further details momentarily. Okay. Sounds like we better get to it. All right. Council mission gateway delays. Reports that we only actively indicate potential shift in the various methods. Abductions are continuing, but else eyewitnesses that the site claimed aliens were releasing an unknown substance into the local environment. Disrupt the alien activity and with a sample of this substance if possible. Okay. Excellent. We look forward to seeing your progress. Launching mission. Dropship has arrived. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Okay. Neutralize all hostages. Targets located and secure their canisters for analysis at HQ. Okay. That object is different from the others. It does not appear to be the same type of pod we've seen used by the aliens during their abduction operations. We may gain new insights if we recover it. Right. Be advised, Commander. Intel confirms enemy activity in this area. Gotcha. Heading to that location. This appears to be a containment device of some kind. We can only assume it has an internal self-destruct mechanism like the other alien equipment. Although it must have already been disabled somehow. Okay. Collected 10 mil. There may be additional canisters like this one in the area. The more we can recover, the more we'll learn about what's inside them. Gotcha. Any others you find may still have operational self-destruct modules. Be careful. I'm on it, Commander. Contact. 
Okay. On the move. Okay, going over there. Find some cover. Send our watch. Spot for a sniper. Hopefully, there's none on the roof. Understood. Moving out. Roger that. Time to kick this sucker off. That's affirmative. coming from that device implies the softest struck mechanism is still intact and priming for detonation. You need to move quickly to recover it before it's too late. It's been 
secured. Okay. Excellent work, Commander. That should provide us with an ample supply of this substance for analysis. Heading there now. Yes, sir. Aye, aye, Commander. Okay. I'm rolling. Okay. I affirmative. Knock her down. On the move. That's affirmative. Affirmative. Moving out. Enemy right. in sight. Oh, shot wide! material should give us a leg up on whatever it is the aliens are developing. I'm sure the doctors will be eager to get started. Excellent. No, XCOM operative is lost or wounded. Substance is remarkable. It's no wonder the only squat wish to witness its effect on human physiology. We can direct those efforts to our own ends, however, their experience may prove a major miscalculation. Remember, we will be watching. Commander, good news. The Council has donated a satellite. Our current satellite uplink facility can support up to two satellites, so I recommend we launch the new one. Immediately. Okay. Launch uh, satellite.
Eh. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Okay. Additional uplink required. With this additional satellite in place, we've gained a significant upgrade to our overall coverage. I recommend we begin scanning for alien contacts right away. Okay. You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive? Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuromuscular... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. We do not know our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it. And interrogate it. Find out what they want. Where they're operating from. Yes. That possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. Okay. Find new research. Construct the alien entertainment fallacy. Research Arcthor. Build an Arcthor. Capture live alien. Okay. We managed to successfully wrap the alien species specimen's entire genome, although I wasn't sure it would be possible using our existing DNA sequencing techniques. However, our success has, our success has led to the sounding relation our this creature's genetic structure is quite similar to our own. This discovery has piqued our, the interest of the research team as it only raises more questions as the origin of the species. Having examined several of the alien corpses, we also observed a trend in the key components of alien genetic structure are mirrored perfectly to, across the, each of the specimens, although it's presumptive at this point to draw any conclusions as to how this is possible. I believe it's only logical to assume that this alien is the practice of an aggressive genetic engineering well beyond anything conceived on Earth. If aliens are truly capable of this sort of manipulation at a cellular level, I fear we may only have scratched the surface of their technological advances over us. In any case, further research is imperative, and we, while we're obviously made a number of discoveries working with the alien courses, I feel we may need to acquire a living specimen if we truly hope to find the answers to these questions. Commander, based on Dr. Valen's report, I recommend we begin researching the new weapon she's calling the Arc Thrower in the labs. Once completed, we can send the plans down to engineering for fabrication, and then equip one of our troops with it in the barracks. Dr. Shen and the engineering team are also waiting on approval for construction of the containment facility that we'll need in order to house the alien captive. Commander to engineering. Kay. Commander to engineering. Okay. Commander, no doubt you are aware of Dr. Valen's request to capture one of the aliens. A sound plan, but she fails to realize that we lack a facility to safely contain a live specimen. With your approval, my team and I will begin construction of a suitable facility. Build facilities. Ok. 
Okay. Thank you, Commander. I'll let you know when the facility is ready. Dr. Valen has asked to see you, Commander. No doubt she wishes to explain her plan personally. Okay. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Commander, I'm sure you've been briefed on my request. With your authorization, we can begin research on the Ark Thrower immediately. Of course. project commander to mission control commander to mission control commander we're picking up widespread radio chatter indicating UFO sightings within our current satellite coverage area we should begin scanning for contacts as soon as possible Satellite coverage now available over China. Come Looks on. like that satellite we launched paid off. We're picking up an unidentified fast mover. If we scramble an interceptor now, we may be able to take it down. Okay. We have eyes on the bandits. Okay. And they're shot, they're shot down to target you. Well, surveillance indicates the enemy crew moving at crash site. Interceptor sustained light damage in the encounter. Central, this is Voodoo 37. We have a confirmed kill on Bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is down. How copy, over? Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify. Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. On that. And Sky Ranger. Edit unit. Run out. Oh, I right, Virus. Edit unit. Run out. Okay. Launch mission. Prepare for deployment, strike one. Okay. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. All right. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike One is authorized to assault the alien craft. Okay. Looks like the crash site is dead ahead. We should expect heavy resistance here. Okay. There's no telling how many hostiles were on board. Approach the craft with caution and attempt a breach if possible. Moving to position. Gotcha. Running. 
Okay, going there. That's what we're looking for. Location confirmed. Got it. Moving. On the move. All right. Double time. Double time. Okay. Not there. Already there. Okay. Target acquired. The repositioning on us. Got the goods. now. The alien craft is still intact. They've got some kind of energy field protecting parts of the ship. We'll have to look for an opening. I'm rolling. Let's go for it. Time to motor. Hostile spotted. Oh crap. So while we're here. Got it covered. Running on overwatch. He's gone on Overwatch. He missed. Whoa! Ah, uh, uh, light damage. Incoming over here.
Come on. Dang it. That is not good. I'm on the move. Oh crap, he's on our watch, sure. Yeah. Dodger, Dodger. He's down. Not down, wounded. Understood. Moving out. Heading to that location. Oh, it's go time. 
The readings coming from that creature are like nothing I've ever seen. You can study it when it's dead, Doctor. Let's take that thing down. No Mission accomplished. All Incredible. Right. It seems to have vanished. Excellent. Got both canisters, too. Got a couple wounded. Well, got promoted to corporal. Excellent. Form. Welcome back, Commander. I wanted to speak to you about our current fleet of interceptors. It's crucial that we keep several of these aircraft on high alert. We'll need them to intercept any future alien contacts, and it's likely we'll suffer some losses in the process. I think it's also worth mentioning that even a full squadron of interceptors will do no good against our enemy if we don't know where they are. Additional satellite coverage will be required before we are able to detect alien craft elsewhere on the planet. Visit us in engineering should you wish to build additional satellites. Goodbye, Commander. Okay. XCOM database. XCOM database provides a running archive of gameplay information and can be accessed anytime via the path menu. Engineering. Search. Navigation control system to recover from the UFO. UFO crash UFO. I think that act with both flight computer and computer simulator. Further state might lead improvements in our ability to detect the incoming use of. Oh, okay. I agree. That does seem to be the most pressing of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report is available. This technology has a number of potential applications. I'm sure the science team is eager to begin. I'll notify you as soon as we have something significant to report. Right. Asia.
Okay. Okay, we're gonna have end part one here. See you in part two. Have a good day. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.